Knowing someone is different from knowing them. And knowing their heart, knowing their love, being in relationship with them. I think of so many sitcoms or TV shows where someone's come up and they've said, oh, yeah, I know you. We were in this class together. And the other person's going, what? We don't know you. We may have something in common, but you don't know me. You don't know my inner thoughts. You don't know what makes me tick. And I think that's what Romans chapter 1 verse 21 is talking about when it says, for although they knew God, they did not honor him as God or give thanks to him, but they became futile in their thinking and their foolish hearts were darkened. Sometimes we can know of God. We can have seen that he is true, but that doesn't mean that it's changed the way we live or the way that we think, the way that we behave. Truly knowing God, knowing his heart, being in relationship with him transforms the way that we live. It transforms us so that we want to honor him as God, that we want to give thanks for all the wonderful, beautiful things that he's doing in our lives. But knowing God without knowing God, Knowing of God without knowing his heart and becoming and pursuing relationship and connection with him is going to lead to a life that doesn't lead to transformation or it leads to decay instead of transformation. Knowing of God without worshiping and thanking God is going to lead us to a place where we're proud or where we think of ourselves as equal to God. Choosing those things that bring us momentary pleasure instead of bringing about ultimate good and the building up of God's kingdom. And so I want us each to honestly ask ourselves, do we know God? Or do we just know of God? And one of the things that's going to be a key indicator of that is, do we honor God as God? Do we give him thanks? Or are we just living life as, all right, God, you're just some higher power out there that's not involved in my life. How do you view God and how do you relate to him? God bless.